Hey guys, welcome back to Melissa's Cricket Creation. All right, I just want to say we've made 500 subscribers. Thank you. Thank you guys. Thank you. Okay. Well, I want to thank everyone that has liked the video, commented, and definitely subscribed. You've helped get us to this far, and I know you're going to help us get to that thousand because now we're on the road to a thousand. So make sure you share this video, okay? Now, today, what I'm going to be talking about in this video is something very quick and simple that I figured out how to do while playing on my phone is changing the skin color of a character, like a popular character, right? Just playing around and I figured it out, all right? So I'm going to share it with you. But before we get started, as always, if you could go ahead and like this video and if you could comment and tell me what character you think you're going to be working on and you're going to change the skin color, if you could put that in the comment section just so I can know what everybody's working on right now. And you know, you know how this goes. I need you to subscribe if you haven't done so already and hit those notifications, turn them on so that you'll be notified every time I drop a video about Cricut and how to make sure you're using your Cricut to the fullest of its ability. If it's with party favors or t-shirts, I got you covered, all right? So let's get to crafting. And we'll always be crafters, crafters. It's just in our blood. Make a t-shirt or a mug. Hobby Live is just for us. All right, guys. So the characters that I'm going to use today are Tommy and Angelica. Okay, so they're from the Rugrats. And I know we see a lot of times that people change their skin color. Um, and it's way easier than you probably even thought. So all you're going to do is first is go to your Google. And when you go to Google, you got to put in, I can't spell, I'm going to put tummy in first. Because uh, we're going to put tummy and I put rug rats just because he ain't the only tummy out here. He ain't the only tummy from the block. And then we're gonna put the words PNG at the end. I always talk about PNG because they're supposed to be a transparent background. Well, we're gonna use this tummy and those checkers in the back let you know it's transparent. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and hold him down. Add to photos, all right? And we're gonna use Angelica. But I don't want y'all to judge me that I'm about to spell her name wrong, okay? I don't know any Angelicas, never had to really spell. Oh, look at her, she just comes up. I already about to embarrass myself. <laughs> All right, here we go. Which one are we gonna use? We'll just use this one because it has a transparent background. And we're gonna add her to photos. So we're gonna do these two rug rat characters and we're gonna change their colors, all right? So let's go to our Cricut Design Space app. And the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna upload the images. So the first time you upload the image, you're gonna select Photo Library. And we're gonna upload, there she is, see? Uh, for some reason, her background is not, there we go. There she is. And we're gonna go to next, next. And so with this, we're gonna save it as a cut image, all right? So we're gonna put in cut image. You can save it as whatever you want to, but this is what I'm gonna save mine as. So saving, saving all my love, all right? She didn't show up just yet. Next, we're gonna go and we're gonna get Tommy, all right? Where's Tommy? There's Tommy. See, because he has, if he's a PNG, you see his background is transparent, so I don't have to press remove. So we just go to next, next, and we're gonna save his cut image. Tommy, cut image, save. Now we have both Angelica and Tommy's cut image, all right? So let's close again. Now we're gonna upload Angelica. And so when I do this, you're gonna be like, what? I didn't even think to do that. Like, it's gonna, it's gonna blow your mind. Press remove again to get rid of that, right? So this is where it gets uh, tricky. Well, not really tricky, but this is the cool part, all right? So we're gonna zoom in. And we're gonna press remove and we're gonna get rid of her face. All right, now let's zoom back out. And we're gonna do her hands anywhere where her skin color is showing. Hands gone. And let's do this other hand. I think that's all, right? Let's look at her. That's it. So let's go next, next. But this time we're gonna save it where it says print to, print to cut. 
So, and I'm just gonna say clear. Save. All right, let's close and let's get tummy. Tummy's ready to come too. And we're gonna bring tummy in, all right? He's already there. Oh, I'm sorry, go back to clean up. Remove, click the remove button at the bottom. And now we're gonna click his face, get rid of that. His hand, his arm, his other arm, leg, leg. See, Tommy's showing out. He has all the skin showing. And we'll get that belly. All right. So cool, we have all his skin. Hold on, hold on. We didn't get those fingers. No finger left behind. Let's get that, and then that. There we go. So some of his toes need to be toe, toe, toe. Uh-oh, undo, zoom in, toe. There we go. We can go down here, toe. You can see at the top with the black and white one, it shows you what is not um, cleaned up, all right? Yeah, I know you already know what I'm about to do, right? So you're like, what? I should have thought of this a long time ago. And that's how I felt, okay? Felt a little bit betrayed. Because I was like, man, who knew it was this simple? This time again, we're going to save the printer cut image, the one that you can actually see what Tommy looks like, right? So let's Tommy clear. And let's save them. All right, next. We're gonna click all of the four images that we just uploaded. And we're gonna make them all the same size. All right, so. I'm just gonna pick a, ra a random size, okay? So we're gonna unlock it. So you see the lock, make sure you unlock it. Let's press edit. And she's 5.7. So let's go here, make this 5.7, our clear option. And it was 8.06, and we're gonna make it 8.06. Now these are just random numbers, like you don't have to do yours these numbers, okay? So six, hold on. So, all right, 8.06. All right, let's do the same thing with Tommy. He's 3.7, let's make this 3.7. And then, so you just want to make them the same size, 6.47, 6.47, all right. So, you know, we call ourselves black. So if we were actually black, this is what we would look like. <laughs> but because we're not actually black, let's uh, switch it to a darker brown. Look at her. All right, so you want to make sure, and then you could just flatten it. All right, let's change her to Pick whatever brown you want to pick. Same thing with Tommy. Let's do the darker brown with him. So you can just pretty much play with the colors and whatever color you like. Let's make, uh, let's use this brown. All right. Uh, let's use another brown. Let's use this one. All right, and all we do from here is I just flatten it, flatten, flatten. And we can make them different colors, but that's pretty much it. Like you just go through and you just find what works best for you. You can always unflatten it or duplicate and just change out the colors and whatever you like best. You know, if you wanna do a lighter color or whatever color you like best. And then you just flatten it, highlight it, flatten it. And now our Rugrats are different colors. What do you guys think? Isn't it like too easy, all right? Well guys, if you enjoyed this tutorial, I know it's quick, it's not that long. I mean, uh, just got straight to the point. If you enjoyed this tutorial, go ahead and like it and comment and let me know if this helped you or what character you wanna do this with. Boss Baby would be a good one, right? A lot of people change them. Um, you know, let me know if, it, if it's something that helped you. And if you want more tips like this, I have a Boss Beginnings group that you could join. 
and uh, it's on Facebook and it'll be in the description. So until next time, guys, stay crafting. <laughs>